Ownership, Responsibility, Accountability. Those are core competencies highly required in today's business world. Phrases and quotes such as, be the captain of your own destiny, take control of your life, are often seen and shared on social media. And probably that control and responsibility is playing against us. How? Well, sometimes we feel responsible for things that are not totally within our control. And for this, I usually share an exercise that I call the Responsibility Traffic Light. The Responsibility Traffic Light is a very simple yet a very powerful exercise that can help you distinguish the things you can control from the ones you cannot control. How does it work? Well, all you have to do is to draw a table with four different columns. On the first column, you're going to make a list of all the things that you worry about. All the things that have the power to use your energy. Thinking about this, how are you going to solve it? What is going to be the outcome? So make a list of all the things that you worry about. Then after that, it's time to classify them. On the first column, it's going to be the green column for those activities that totally depend on you. In front of each of the activities that you have described, each of the things that worry you somehow, you will write a check mark if totally depends on you. For the second column, this amber column is devoted for those things that partially depend on you. You can do a certain thing, but the outcome does not necessarily depend 100% on you. So you write a check mark on all those things that worry you, that partially depend on you. That's the amber column. And then, obviously, you have the red column. The red column goes for all those things that worry you, that now that you have a list, now that you think about it, they don't necessarily depend on you. You have no control over them. Most of the people that perform this exercise find out that most of the things that they worry about are actually in the third column. They are in the red section of the traffic light. There's nothing you can do. And that is why we are worried and stressed without reason. There's nothing we can do because it is beyond our control, but we haven't stopped to think about it. Probably, it would be a good time to remember that serenity prayer attributed to Reinhold Niebuhr. God, grant me the serenity to accept the things I cannot change. Courage to change the things I can, and wisdom to know the difference. And precisely, knowing the difference, doing exercises like this, can help you increase your emotional paycheck. I'm Dr. Jaime Leo, Director of the Emotional Paycheck, and I remind you that you can always give a raise in the check that really matters, the Emotional Paycheck. Emotional Paycheck Institute of Canada.